So nice to see the sun out today, but a break in the freeze doesn't mean our problems have ended. The effects of the last week will be costly ones. Insured losses are expected to be in the billions of dollars. 12 on your side's Marilyn Moritz on what typical homeowners policies cover and what you should do before you file a claim. So all the, all the water is under the house. We've barely begun to thaw and Jacob has a mess of water underneath his house. Busted water pipes. It appears to be that it's, it's going to be a, a bigger project than what we were hoping it was going to be to get us some water again. He may be filing an insurance claim. Already, USAA alone has been flooded with 38,000 winter storm claims, most for frozen and busted pipes. So what's typically covered? The homeowner policy does cover the ensuing water damage, and uh, it will also most of the time cover the frozen pipes in these situations that burst. Of course, coverage and limits can vary depending on individual policies and carriers. USAA's Elizabeth Gulick suggests homeowners inspect their plumbing. Look under cabinets where the sinks are. Look around the tub and the toilets. Look up in the ceiling. And if you see or hear a problem, locate your main water cutoff valve so you can cut the water. And something else you can file a claim for, spoiled food from the power outages. And with the food, the deductible probably does not apply. If you do have damage, she says document, take pictures, video, keep receipts for any related expenses, and contact your insurer to understand your coverage and file a claim as soon as possible. When it comes to hiring a plumber, Ask for a plumbing license, you know, ask them for their plumbing license. Beware, and don't give no money up front. And be patient. I'm hoping that we're going to be able to have some water restored by Tuesday. Marilyn Moritz, KSAT 12 News.